Hello and welcome to another episode of Citrix Microlearning. This video will guide you on how to update an existing certificate key pair on the Citrix ADC appliance. Certificate key pair definitions on the Citrix ADC appliance are used to define the server certificate bound to a load balancing, content switching, or Citrix gateway virtual server. When a certificate nears expiration, the bound certificate key pair can be updated without prior removal. First, let's take a look at our current certificate key pair binding. Opening our load balancing virtual server properties, we look inside the certificate section to view the current server certificate bound. Once on screen, use the action button and choose details from the drop down menu. Within those details, we see the certificate is expired according to the valid to field. Click Close to exit from the Details view. Now from the Action button, choose Update Certificate. Next, select the Update the Certificate and Key checkbox to open access to the file name fields. Then proceed with selecting the Replacement Certificate. In our example, we are reusing the existing key. However, you are free to choose a new key if you replaced it when creating the new certificate. If the replacement certificate was a PFX file, you would choose it within the certificate file name and it would auto-populate within the key field as well. The Notify checkbox enables an optional SNMP alarm that can notify you when the expiration of the certificate is approaching. Click OK to complete the process. If an intermediate certificate was already linked, then it will be unlinked in the event that the replacement certificate comes from a different intermediate authority. Returning to the binding view, use the action button and select details to view evidence of the successful replacement. Outside of the virtual server binding, the certificate key pair definition can also be updated directly within the server certificates node of the ADC GUI. Again, use the action button to select Update. 